Well, still on COVID-19, Frontier Health Services, the company contracted to carry out COVID-19 tests at the airport, has paid $1.1 million as royalties to the state for October to December 2020. The Transport Minister, Kwekwe Siyama, who made this known while responding to an urgent question filed by the minority leader, Haruna Idrisu, noted every contractual agreement between government and the company has been met. Government engaged Frontiers Healthcare Solution Services Limited to conduct the rapid COVID-19 test following the reopening of the airport to international passenger flights in September 2020. None as passengers coming to Ghana by air are required to pay $150 for a 30-minute PCR COVID-19 test. Frontier Services Agreement with the Ghana Airport Company to conduct the COVID testing came under heavy scrutiny, especially from the minority in parliament. After months of inquest and controversy over the $150 charge on the testing, President Okufado directed the reduction of the fees for Ghanaians holding Equus passports to $50. Between September and December 2020, the total amount relied from the COVID-19 testing at the Kotoka International Airport was $17 million. $359,500. As per the concession agreement, as stated earlier, Frontier Health Services retained $16,202,200 for its services from September to, this, to December 2020. The Ghana Airport Company Limited, on the other hand, received $1,000,000. $157,300 for the same period as royalties accruing for COVID-19 testing. Transport Minister Kwekwe Siyama says government will strictly ensure what is due the state is collected. The minority in parliament had raised red flags about possible procurement breaches and demanded documents to ascertain if due diligence was done. I don't think that any onto, anything on top that has happened in terms of the arrangement about royalties that our client paid to us to warrant any termination. 